Hey, I'm just doing a video of the, um, a little review about Noble 6, recently bought, Blue Hayabusa Terrible Condition, and then the 10 Combat Elite, he's okay condition. Well, first off, Noble 6 is actually a pretty great figure. He's like, the design and stuff is pretty darn cool. Like, the gun, you can tell it's actually from the assault rifle and stuff. Comes with the peg so you can place it on his back. And it comes with a grenade, like, silver topped, kind of. Which you can place on the pegs on the back of his belt. Um, you could customize this figure. You could take off his chest plate. Then you could also take off his helmet. Not very easily. Not very easily at all. Oh, there we go. Anyway, you could customize him with other figures if you have any. So it's like pretty cool. It's the standard Spartan Mark IV. Mark VB, anyway, from Halo Reach. Silver and steel colors. Oh, and then we place back on his helmet. There we go. And then now his chest plates. Right here. The detail is pretty cool. You can see, like, everything. It's like the actual figure from the game. Like, you know it's from Reach. Like, backpack and everything. Pretty, pretty cool. Let's move on to the 10, um, Elite. Alright, the 10 Elite is, like, pretty much like a normal Elite. You could take off chest plate, take off his helmet, hold on. Right here, they're not the cutest looking objects ever. But you can see that, like, detail is pretty cool on the top of his head. So, like, you can see. And then his red eyes. I can see you. Anyway, you can take off, also take off his shoulder plates. And then, the other one. You can also customize them with other figures. Detail is pretty good, but only thing I gotta say about this figure, the hands are terrible. Like seriously, they can. I barely even managed to get these maulers in these. Like the only weapons I can make them hold properly, like the hinges and stuff. Ugh. But anyway, at least I got them to hold these. The maulers came in the Hayabusa set, which I got quite a while ago. Anyway, here's the Hayabusa. I'd honestly give Noble 6 a uh, 4 out of 5. I would give him a 5 if he had more custom ability. Honestly. So, and, um, I'd give the Elite a 3. He's a good figure and all, but his fingers, like, messes everything up. The hinges, it's like... Anyway, here's the Hayabusa. I have lost the shoulder plates to it, like, a big dummy. <laughs> he has. You can customize the Hayabusa any way you want with other Halo 3 figures. Um, the paint job's really good. Like, and then the crown. Like, it's it's pretty darn good. He could hold the standard weapons of Halo 3, and like, you could tell it's a Hayabusa instead of just like messing it up. Like. I'm not a, I'm late. Like toys. It's pretty good. I got this at Walmart for only ten bucks. It's a pretty good deal. Thank you for watching, and I am the Noble Nine. Please subscribe and comment.